Welcome back to Mash Tips. While you watch this video, you already have a couple of air tags with you. Did you ever try this air tag with your e-bike or probably use in your car? So what's gonna happen if somebody steal your e-bike with the air tag? After a while, if it's an iPhone user, they're gonna get a pop-up on their screen. They can play a sound on your air tag and eventually he can find it out and remove it. What about an Android user? He can get a sound alert from this air tag after a while. Even though he is not in Apple ecosystem, he can locate the device with that sound and take it off from your e-bike. How do you avoid that? Unfortunately, Apple is not giving you an option to disable the speaker. So there is only one way to do that at this point, just to remove the speaker from the air tag. Let us see how to do that. Let us see how to remove the internal speaker of this air tag. I mean, tell you this is not that much easy. If you are not good at it, do not try for this thing. But anyway, for those who want to remove the speaker, you have to do that. So first of all, you have to remove the battery and it's a CR2032. You can easily take it off. I'm using two tools at this point. It's a sharp chooser and I'm pretty sure this is going to make some mark on this body of this air tag while you remove in the case. And there is a very small tip, flat screwdriver. These are the two tools I'm gonna use it. And first of all, just wanna give you some idea about the air tag here. So these are the battery contacts. This is for the negative side, and these two are for the positive side. So once you insert the battery like this, the negative part get contact here, and the top part of the cell get contact here, the sidewise. Once you remove the battery, you can see a light gray part and white part. You can take this gray part off from the body itself. So you have to get a sharp screwdriver and try to insert between this white body and the light gray part. And when you try that, make sure not to try on this area because these two battery contacts are going here next to the frame. So try somewhere here, either this part or here. So this is the best spot that doesn't have any components over there. So we can try it this area for that. So this is the one we already tried and we just basically poke a hole here with a screwdriver and gradually move around the screwdriver around this air tag and finally pop it up. And if you see any difficulty to do that, use an hair dryer and blow some hot air to this part because this part is glued together with the body. So it's good to have some hot air to melt that glue. Don't try to make it too much hot. A mild heat will work. Here is the case that we almost coming out. Here is the air tag, finally you got it. This is the tiny speaker. This is the battery contact. Try to insert the screwdriver around here or here. So once you have the battery contact here, it's better to try on this side or this side to take off that plate. Here is a plastic plate we took out, the light gray color, and here is a speaker. And the speaker, while you take, you can see this is the coil, uh, goes into the speaker for making the noise. If you don't want to break the coil, use your tuser, try to take off from this side. Do not touch the coil at a space here and simply take off the speaker. And here is the speaker. There you go. And here is the top part of the speaker. And if you flip it, you can see a tiny slot here. That's where this coil goes in. This is the battery contacts and rest of the circuitry here. You can see a couple of SMD chips around the shape of PZB. We have to put it back without speaker. I mean, move this around and make sure these three holes goes into this battery contacts right here. Align that battery contacts into this hole and there you go. Make sure that the battery contacts come into these three holes. Family press it. You can apply some glue before you put it back. Otherwise, so there is a chance to pop up this case back. So I would recommend to apply some glue over there. And now we can try with our battery. Make sure everything is working good with your iPhone and let me try to find out. Find my, let me move this away from the phone and it's showing it's away. And here you go. Here is a tag 
without speaker so it won't make any sound even though you try to make sound is showing that is making sound or you can try to play sound here and it won't make any sound but still you can use to find out your devices on find my app before you finish the setup i would strongly recommend to apply some glue on the side of this air tag instead of trying on inside so if i want to take it off i can take off later and i don't want to apply too much glue so what i recommend took a glass piece or something and a drop of glue over there and take that glue out from here to glue together at least a couple of places between this white and gray frame make sure it's closely tied together I glued at least three different places it's a very tiny spot i don't wanna apply too much glue over there so i just applied in three spots and when you glue together the case should properly insert it to get the battery contact so make sure that you apply some glue over that battery contact area wait a few seconds for the glue to work together and here we go and look like we are good to go let me try the battery back and finally the metal cover and twist it and it's treated now so i'm good to go there you go so everything is working even without a speaker you can put it back to your case if you have any keychain or anything you want to try there you go all good so here is the final layer tag that we remove the speaker So you have removed the speaker from the air tag and now you can place this air tag on your e-bike and we have published another video for the best air tag tips and you can see the link here are you going to remove the speaker is it worth to remove the speaker from the air tag or do you think apple have to offer the feature to disable the speaker from the air tag let us know your thoughts and meanwhile don't forget to subscribe our channel click on the subscribe button here and press the bell icon for latest updates Thank you for watching the video and we will come back with another one.